Hello. I'm so glad you're going to read this book with me today because I am very excited. I really, really like this book. It's so much fun. There's dancing and there's rhyming words. And did I say there's dancing? Super fun. I hope you really like it. It's called Hilda Must Be Dancing and it's by Karma Wilson and illustrated by Suzanne Watts. Let's open up the cover and see what's inside. I think you're going to like it. Hilda must be dancing. Hilda Hippo loved to dance, and so each day she practiced hard. She'd twist and turn and whirl and twirl, dressed in her favorite leotard. She'd spin a pretty pirouette, then leap and land on tiptoe. She tangoed oh so gracefully and square danced with a do si -do. And while she danced in utter bliss, it sounded quite a lot like this. Kabump, kabump, crash, crash, smash. Thumpity bump, thumpity bump, boom, bang, bash. The jungle floor would shake and quake. A tidal wave would fill the lake. Her friends would shout. For goodness sake. Hilda must be dancing. Look at her friends, the monkey, the elephant, and there's another monkey. For goodness sake, Hilda must be dancing. They all hoped Hilda's hobby was a stage that soon would pass. But after one loud shaky year, they knew this phase would last. And last, and last. Oh, look at the ladybug. While Hilda danced flamenco in her favorite pair of heels, bananas fell in gooey heaps, shaken from their peels. Oh my goodness, look at the bananas. Swisher, swisher, clap, 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 jump, jump, jump. I even like her shoes. And she has a rose in her teeth. And I think she's holding cascanets. Did you know cascanets are a musical instrument flamenco dancers use when they dance? It's wooden blocks that they clap together, clap, 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 as they dance. Hilda has been dancing and shaking bananas from their peels. What do you think the other jungle animals have been thinking? Hilda must be dancing, cried the monkeys from the trees. Perhaps she'll take up knitting if we ask her pretty please. Hilda tried to sit and knit. She didn't like it, not one bit. The yarn got tangled, so she quit. I think I'll stick to dancing. Oh look, her yarn got stuck around the monkeys. She rumbled and she sumbled in her favorite flowered skirt. She skipped across the crowded plains and kicked up clouds of dirt. Hippa, hippa, bounce, bounce, thump, thump, thump. I like her skirt and her shoes and her hat. But look at all that dust that she is kicking up. 
It's clouds of dirt. And look in her hands. This time she doesn't have cascanets. She's holding maracas. How fun. And what do you think these animals are saying? Hilda must be dancing, said the rhinos in distress. If she'd only take up singing, then she wouldn't make a mess. Look at all that mess. Hilda tried to hum and croon, but she found she couldn't hold a tune. She tired of it very soon. I think I'll stick to dancing. <laughs> Look at the elephant. He has earmuffs so he can't hear her singing. And the monkey looks like he's saying, oh my. But I'll give it to Hilda. She gave singing a try, even if she can't hold a tune very well. At the water hole, she boogied in her favorite disco pants. She muddied up the river and she trampled down the plants. Shake a shake a boom boom, bump bump bump. Look at her doing her disco dance with her disco pants, but she is trampling the plants with her shoes. Hilda must be dancing, wailed the water buffalo. If only she'd take up swimming, we might get some peace, you know. Oh, there the water buffalo. And so, what do you think's gonna happen? Hilda wallowed by the shore. She'd never felt so grand before. Now here's a hobby I adore. Oh, look at the fish and a monkey. And there's even a dragonfly. Water ballet dancing in her favorite two-piece suit. She whirled and twirled with flair. Best of all, the ground stayed still. She floated light as air. She looks so happy doing her water ballet. And while she swam and danced in bliss, it sounded quite a lot like this. Kerplop, plunk, dunk, swish, kilometer grub, splash, sploosh, splish. A big crowd gathered at the shore. They cheered and clapped and called for more. Her friends cried out, Hooray! Encore! Hilda, keep on dancing! And so she did. Isn't that fun? She finally found a place she could dance that didn't bother her friends. So everyone is happy. The animals are happy. Even the monkeys and the water buffalo and the rhinos and the lion, and Hilda is happy. Do you remember when I told you there were words that rhyme in this story? That I liked that it was a story about dancing and rhyming? Let's talk about some of these words that rhyme. On this page, there's the word hard and leotard. Hilda practiced hard wearing her favorite leotard. There's also the words 
toe and do -si do that rhyme. She would land on her tippy toe and square dance with the do -si do Toe, do, both end in the O sound and they are rhyming words. Toe, do. Let's see if there is more. Oh, there are several rhymes on this page. Bliss, this, rhyme. Smash, bash, rhyme. And the word quake and lake and sake, rhyme. Quake, lake, sake. They all rhyme. So, what did you think of the story? Did you like it? Did you like Hilda? Did you like the rhyming words? Me too! Let's do some more rhyming words right now. I have these cards, and I think you can help me find words that rhyme with them. Let's give it a try, okay? Here's our first word. D O G, d, a, g, d, a, g, dog, dog, dog. D O G spells dog. Now we need to look for a word that rhymes with dog, and to rhyme, the last two letters need to sound the same. So dog, dog, og, og. Hmm. Hey, what's that animal that's green and jumps and says, ribbit, ribbit? Yes, yes. Frog, frog rhymes with dog. Frog and dog are words that rhyme. Let's see what other words rhyme. That's dog, we know that, D-O-G. B-O-G is bog. F-O-G is fog. And there, that's the word frog. Frog. It rhymes with dog. Good job. This word is spelled C-A-R. R, k R, car, car, it's a car, k R. Okay, we need to find words that rhyme with the R, k R, k R. What do you think? Hmm. Hey, what's that thing that twinkles up in the night sky? And we wish on it? Yes, a star. Car, star. I think they rhyme. Let's see. Oh, we have car, C A R, J R, J A R, F R, F R, far. And look, st. R, S T A R, star. All these words rhyme. Car, jar, far, star. Do you know what this word is? I think you guessed already. It's moon. M, oon. M, oon. The middle letters, the two O's together kind of make that oo sound. M -oon. Moon. What rhymes with moon? Moon. Hmm, let's see. Can you help me read these words? This one is m -oon. How about this one? The first letter is N. N, 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 un. Noon, yes. 
S O O N. S O N. S O N. Soon. Fantastic. Last one. Sp O N. Sp O N. Spoon. Spoon. Great. We have moon, noon, soon, and spoon that all rhyme. Well, we just had the moon, so I had to do this one, of course. What is that? It's the sun. Sun. It's the sun. You knew it was the sun. Okay. A word that rhymes with sun, sun. I know one, and it makes me think of you. The word F-U-N, fun, fun. It has been fun rhyming these words with you and reading the book about Hilda, the hippo who liked to dance. Let's see. Un, sun. Oh, this is a good one. R, un, run. B, un, like a hamburger bun or a hot dog bun. And there it is. Fun, f, un, sun, run, bun, fun, all rhyme. And we have had some fun reading this book and rhyming words. I look forward to reading with you again soon. Thanks for making today fun.